Good morning. In this video we will see how to create a parametric subroutine by means of the base tools of TP ACAD. Let's start by creating a new program. Assign now two variables. R0 is the diameter of the holes, R1 is the hole pitch. Open the view of the top face. And insert a hole with variable diameter. Duplicate the hole, and move the Y coordinate. Now, select the two holes and duplicate them, with symmetry along the length of the piece. As you can see, the X coordinate of the new holes keeps the rule of applied symmetry. Select the holes, and duplicate them with symmetry along the length of the piece. Also the Y coordinate of the new holes keeps the rule of the applied symmetry. As you can see, if we change the length of the piece and the position of the holes, the symmetry rules we set are complied. Now, select the four holes on the left side of the piece. We duplicate them, by applying a positioning along the line of the piece, and we set the X and the midpoint of the length, the four holes actually hold the programmed position. Now, select the four holes in the center of the piece, and apply an if and if block of conditional statement. The four programming lines of the holes are now enclosed in their if and if cycle. Condition the execution of the cycle by checking the length of the piece. Apply the logical conditionings, whose length is programmed equal to 1000 mm. The logical cycle is verified, and the four holes are represented graphically. Now, change the length of the piece at 800. As you can see, now the logical cycle is not verified, and the four holes are not graphically represented. The yellow face on the lines shows the new situation. Insert now X fitting working. Choose the position for the insertion outside the logical cycle, and set a variable pitch. Duplicate the X fitting with symmetry, along the height of the piece. Then, change the length and the height of the piece. The workings now fit the position, according to the rules applied on the coordinates. Lastly, change the value of the variables. Here also the workings fit the position, and the geometry according to the new values of the variables. I hope this video has helped you. Please, search within our video channel on YouTube, or on our Facebook page, where you will find other tutorials of TP ACAD, or of other TPA's applications.